Hey what's up everybody my name is TrophyNut and welcome back to The Witcher 3 on the Death March difficulty. We're still playing the Hearts of Stone DLC and we're still at the Von Everak estate in a desperate attempt to talk to Olgird's wife, well late wife, Iris, and uh, we need to find a place to bury her. And uh, the ghost dog and cat, these two guys, talk to us about the front garden where Iris loved to spend some time. So we need to find a fitting spot, and I think those flowers we found in f up front here might do, so let's see. Iris von Everek adored flowers. But she would never want to destroy them. That's also a good mm. idea. Right. I'll dig the grave somewhere else. A good sentiment, so let's see, maybe up here, next to the painting? Looks like we found our spot. This place seems suitable. Yes, she loved to paint. Did but who Iris are you guys? Have any last requests? Say how she wanted her remains disposed of? She feared death. Worried none would see to her burial or say a kind word in parting. Guess I'll be the one to do that. Yes, indeed. I actually think we should get all geared and get him over here, but... He might already be aware that she died. That was quick. Iris was Olgir von Everek's wife. Well, that's not really a way to describe someone, right? I didn't know her. Was a talented painter. I didn't know Iris von Everek. I didn't know Iris von Everek, so I can't say much about her. Fate had it a stranger now lays her remains in the grave. At times, fate muddles our path, and life turns toilsome, hard to bear. Yet all deserve respite and peace and death. Okay. Place her sketch pad on the grave. Let's do that. Your name's inscribed in this sketchbook. Perhaps you'd like it to be buried with you. Okay, you do got anything to add? You too. Got any last words for your mistress? We don't partake in human rituals. Oh, Trust sorry. Trust what you've done is in keeping with your customs. Okay then. But where did these two guys come from then? Well, maybe Gontor Odim has something to do with that. Let's try to summon her. The remains are interred. Let's summon her. Hmm. Maybe Gontor does have something spirit. to do with it. I've laid your bones to rest. Forget your wrath. Forget your grief. Show oh? yourself. The candles were lit. Hello, Iris. I believe you've looked better. Forgive me for tearing you from your realm. I need to ask you. She's not in the mood. Because those two look like those uh, Darkness Spirits cards we saw using... Uh, Hilbert used that in his Grant deck. Okay. I'm hoping we might get a glimpse of what she looked like. Yes, that's probably what the estate looked like before it was... Uh, it fell to ruin. Should I follow you? Alright. Oh. This is gonna be weird. Oh, this is awesome. What is this place? Kinda reminds me of uh, the Elder Scrolls Oblivion. Because it kinda looks like that as well. Wow, look at that. That's amazingly done. The painted world. The work of Iris von Everek. That's cool. How do you two get in here? We exist in both worlds at once. Okay, tell me more. Strange place. One born of Iris von Everek's dreams. It existed only in her mind while she lived. In death it gained substance. That Pretty is very interesting. Tale. 
Hard as hell to believe. Yet you'd best believe it, and be on your guard. The painted world is rife with danger. Oh, great. Another boss fight? Where did she go? Alright, this is lovely and all, but where's Iris? You awoke her, but for a moment. If you wish to speak to her, you must tear her from her slumber completely. Sure, but how? Get back in the house? The tracker, right? Saw you examining the tracks outside. Yeah, so? This is a world built of memories blurred and wilting. Moments our mistress wishes to forget, but cannot. So we follow the you tracks. You need to find them, restore them, summon the fears that torment Iris, and destroy them. Okay then. Easy to say. That sounds interesting. So this is the first place that's lit up. Let's see what we can... Wow, this is actually pretty cool. I wonder how they did this, because it's really, really cool. Some co kind of post-processing effect, probably, but... Sorry, sorry. Force of Spectres habit. Have and his wife, but why aren't they moving? Because they're memories. This is a memory. There we go. But it's incomplete. Blurred. You must peer closely and restore it. So maybe we can find out what Old Geard was up to with his wife. Maybe there wasn't... There weren't all the... Uh, they made up to be. Because maybe Old Geard made that sound a bit more happy than it was, actually. So we have a teapot. Tableware for an afternoon tea or breakfast. Painter's palette. And now we have a book of some sort. The Spirit, the from, spirit the step. from the Step. Let's read that. Read often, well worn. Might man yet learn his neck to bend? Ha, behold how that noble race doth year by year its birthright rend, its promised lands fast laid to waste. Hearts grown cold, brothers, brothers spurn. The rich grow fat while poor grow thin. Some hoard bread, others can but yearn, then rise on mass to slay their kin. Taste ye now my missive's fruits, feed on them, O heartless brutes. This world you've bit with cruel tipped fangs, your dark crime's venom now through it seeps. Above God's wrath in wild clouds hangs, a cleansing storm soon to unleash. A man, a riddle stuck in sleep, a grub unwrapped in spittle, Beneath the tumult of raging skies, waits and grows little by little, till at last a bright ray it spies, spreads new wings and away it flies. May this thought with man endure, may we ever in heart recall this merry creature, winged and pure, and how it started so strange so small. However seeks from flesh a cure, the skies above doth plead and call, may in this soul our tale hope stir. And that's the end of it. Sorry, I thought it was going to be bigger than that. What's this? There's flames over here. Hmm. So this is probably... probably wait, 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 wait. No. Wait a second. Because we can interact with this as well. But it's probably from the front. He's reading the book. He's reading the book, yeah. Perfect match. So he's reading the book. Over here... You probably need to paint this palette. Perfect match. There we go. And the teapot was a dupe. There we go, they're moving. We should get a dog. Or a dog and a cat. Even better. Hello, when the Iris. Comes, the dog will warm my feet and the cat will play with a ball of yarn by the fire. What do you think? All geared? Are you even listening? Apologies, dear. Had my mind on my book. Is it that terribly absorbing? Hmm? Yes, uh, terribly. Know what? Let's go inside. Why? It's lovely out here. The birds singing, the bees buzzing. Blissful, really. Sorry, dear. I feel unwell. I'll go in. You stay a while longer.
She kind of sounds high as a kite. She's talking really strangely. And I'll get left. But we probably won't be able to follow him. Okay, bees. We need to fight bees. Can I fight bees? What is that? Another memory? Oh god. That looks like a zombie of some kind. No, a nightmare. A fear embodied, which sooner or later you will have to confront. Looks like another boss fight to me. Luckily I can eat in this place. So there's the shadowy stuff everywhere as well. So there's the next memory. Oh shit! There's more! Okay, my sword is broken, so let's check it out. The world map is ob obviously uh, disabled, because we can't really check out the map if we're not really in the world anymore. Let's see, let's use one of these journeyman's repair kits and boost that back up to 90, I think. Yeah, that's 90, and this one is 85, so let's keep it at that. There we go, I probably must have uh, broken it pretty much during the wraith fight. So let's destroy the bees. Another memory. Okay. So let's check out the bouquet of flowers. For a special occasion. And then we have a gloss. Just like the one Olgir's holding. Okay, and then we have the third item is this wedding veil. Wedding veil. Is this their wedding? Wait, so she is probably holding the other cup. Perfect match. There we go. Your health. My that was the only item we needed, apparently. And yours, my husband. In my land, custom calls that newlyweds be greeted with bread and salt. But we're alone for now. I need none but you. Oh, if only this moment could last forever. I shall see what I can do. But come in and see our home. Glad they look really that... happy. I know this sounds silly, yet the house has sat empty for so long and I'm... Afraid of spiders. I know, I know. I swept them all up and tossed them in the garden. My night... You've seen to everything. Oh, there's another spider. Or ghost spiders. Memory spiders. Oh, hi. Whoa, this is a big one. Ooh. Holy shit. Holy shit, this thing is big. This thing is big. So that's the big one. That calmed down the other one, apparently. Oh, no. There 
There we go. That's all of the spider. Oh, Same wow. Figure. This one turned real. And that other zombie probably appeared again. Okay, so let's head inside. I heard a door opening and closing over here, so... Another let's dream see. of the past. Bet this one's incomplete too. Let's Lavish see. Lavish feast. Trying to impress the guests. Silver thread. Pearls. It all must have cost a fortune. Okay, there's a so jug on the floor here. Mello. A Toussaint wine. Expensive. Toussaint? So that's for uh, blood and wine, by the way. And then a giant painting. That's... That's a painting of the scene that we're witnessing right now. Use your witcher senses to find a way to restore the... Huh. Looking at that... We're sitting in the correct positions. Olgird's wife liked flowers. Judging by the ornamentation, this might be hers. Okay, but how do we fix the memory? Because at a first glance, there's nothing really wrong with this. Except... Fire was burning in the painting. Still something missing, though. Yeah, okay. Also need lighting. Okay, so that's Ignite. Wait. Are they all lit? No, the last one isn't lit, so... Let's extinguish that. And let's light the first two. Candles also need lighting. There we go. I'm liking these puzzles though. My darling, is everything alright? You seem pale out of sorts. Everything's fine, really. But why don't you tell me how you fare? I'm ever so happy to see you. Except, why didn't Grandmama and Grandpapa come? So that must be it's Iris's long, parents. Like journey. Maddie. They still refuse to meet me. Is that it? And what's Seems, this? Seems uh, like there's a problem with the parents-in-law. cherished doll. Ah, and uh, this for you. Bank notes. We paid off your debts, bought them out, to avoid bringing shame to the family. Wait a second. I thought. So nice of Mama and Papa to remember me. Olga. I thought. Yeah, he now told us something different, change. right? I warned you before the wedding. A ruffian and a boar who keeps the company of bandits. Are you not afraid to live under one roof with that rabble? Apparently she isn't. And now he's a ghost. Oh god. So Olgir told us that... That, um... Make me wait. They forced him out of the relationship because he lost all his money, but they tried to fix it. Oh, he's a slow attacker. Let's go, old geared spectre. There we go. Not you again. And there's the uh, the fear demon, or whatever you want to call it. So that's what that memory. So that, now we'll probably place. need to head upstairs. And the painted world doesn't look so cool anymore, sorry. With all the specters and zombies. But still, it's nicely done. What am I saying? It's nicely done. I mean, look chamber. at it. Okay, the bed chamber. She's uh She don't she doesn't have much on her. But we still need to find something probably. Bloody towel. Towel stained with blood. Okay, Olgird is standing over here. 
So that's probably where that needs to be. Something happened. What time is it? It's late. Sleep. Up all night in your study again, I see. What have you got on your hands? Blood. Nothing. Got a bit dirty, that's it. Is that blood? Have you hurt yourself? Ink stains. I was writing letters. I shall go to Oxen first, soon. Perhaps you'd come with me. Oh, that's a marvellous idea. A trip would do us both so much good. Then it's decided. Now, time for bed. I'm exhausted. I shan't fall asleep now. It's out of the question. Come, I shall finish your portrait. So he was clearly hiding something back then as well. We still don't know how the relation ended then. Why are they they're standing over there again? Go to the painting study studio. Okay then. He's posing for his portrait. A blurred memory. This one looks dark. So whatever went wrong, it probably happened here. The glass. Let's check out the painting and see what he's supposed to be holding. Because he's not really holding anything, is he? Oh, the goblet is behind him. But the details are off. Living Tableau's missing something. Living Tableau's gotta look just like the painting. Choose a place for the goblet. Goblet in the middle, goblet on the right. So let's go back because I need to check that out first. Mm, still not right. Let's see. The goblet is on the right. Living tableau's got. So let's choose a place for the goblet and put it on the right. Here. In the middle, then. Maybe on this side. Okay, leave then. Still on the painting right. it looked on the right side, so we need to find the other pieces as well. So there's fruit over here. Nope, that was not what I wanted to do. The fruit Fresh, bowl. As if someone just rinsed it. And then... We need to put that to the left of the... Living goblet. has got to look just like the painting. Yes, it needs to. The apple on the right. This goes here. And then the grapes on the left. Fits, I think. There we go. Finally, just like the picture. Those are it's giant grapes. Wider. Like this. Yes, like that. You were meant to smile, not bare your teeth. No, still wrong. Smile like you did when Papa agreed we could marry. Please? Be nice to one another. You're useless. I can tell something's bothering you. I have a bit of work I should see to. Again, I would be distracted if uh, there's a woman standing like that over there. keep any secrets from one another. We promised. Forgive me. I don't wish to discuss this. And he left. Oh, now we need to follow that again, probably. All geared. To the other side of the staircase. There goes the door. Something gonna spawn in the room? Hi. We still don't need to fight you. But we might need to fight something Ugly here. Bastard. I can't see shit in here as well. Let's put the shield back on. So there's two left. Now 
that's that, I suppose. Jesus Christ, that was a lot. Another door opens. This is starting to look like a dungeon crawler going from one room to the next. So, we have Master another memory. Study. Here he immersed himself in the arcane arts. The arcane arts? That's new. Pentagrams here to bind summoned beings. Lines aren't all clear, though. Need chalk to fix them. Then I can set out the candles. Okay. So let's find the chalk. Blood packs or on foreign Blood presences. Or on foreign presences. Whosoever summons a visitant into our realm risks much. Whether flickering as a spirit in the eater or inhabiting the flesh of a designated host, the visitant shall strive to attain its liberty, and if it does, it shall wreak great havoc. Thus a visitant must be summoned only within a protective circle, which shall bind it as no fetus could. The circle must be complete and eternal with no ruptures. Its line must be drawn with a steady hand firmly gripping the chalk. Since a stray step may through carelessness or the visitant's trickery can smudge the line, the circle must be further secured by a barrier in the form of lit candles made of beeswax. The circle thus protected shall stand as a sure and inescapable prison for the visitant. Is mm, Gontro Dim... Parleying with demons. Is Gontro Dim a visitant? Because that sounds like a very apt description. Here's the chalk. Chalk. So let's finish this thingy. Maybe I should take the candles first. These wax candles. So let's finish the chalk uh, and put the candles magic. down. That should do it. Now for the candles. Or is the zombie we've uh, seen before? Is that the visitant? Place candles on the vertices of the pentagram. Place candles on the circle surrounding the pentagram. Place candles on both the vertices and the circle. Well, we read the book, so we should be placing them on the circle. How about this? Come back! We must talk! Go away. I wish to be alone. Not this time. Come out at once! Leave me be. I merely want to work in peace. It's sad to see something like that happen. Because they clearly love each other, but... He's hiding something from her. And it looks like it's black magic. What are you up to, Olgird? Is he gonna summon Gontrodim? That's gonna be awesome. If that happens. Gonna be a big revelation, that one. spell must I use, damn it. I've tried them all. I wish to end our pact. I summon thee! Well, that looks like it worked. And the candles are out. Damn it! Oh. Oh, God. Fire! In here, quickly! The veins! Dance the veins! I did not expect that. Find a way to escape the fire. Oh wow, the painting. <coughs> Examine the painting. 